Griffin families. Um, I hope you're well and had a lovely half term break and um, welcome back for our final term, uh, summer two. Um, can we explore it is our topic this term. Um, our PE day is still going to be on a Friday um, and sports day details will be sent out in due course for Mini Griffins as well. Um, so for this term um, in English we're going to be focusing on developing play around our favourite stories so children will be able to, will, they'll be encouraged to choose their own story in the in the uh, in the area um, and bring it to us and we can read it and then we can try and retell the story through um, acting it out and making um, dens or making um, the, the story come to life basically so supporting this at home is just really allowing your children to um, den build at home you can use all everyday objects um, in the home or in the garden like your chairs and your sheets and just letting them use that imaginative play which is also going to really focus on their communication and language development because um, they'll be able to make their own decisions um, and that will help um, their, their conversation between um, if they've got brothers and sisters if not with mum and dad as well or grandparents or whoever um, to, to encourage that language rich environment. Uh, physical development this term um, again we're going to be focusing on letting the children get creative let them um, familiarise themselves with different resources, everyday objects, and bringing bits and bobs together and letting them make what they want to make, basically. It could be something like on the playground, we'd make um, the wheels on the bus go round and round and we can all get creative and pretend we're on the bus. Um, so for maths this term, we're going to be focusing on using different mathematical language um, by seeing if the children are able to compare amounts by saying lots more and the, and the, and the same. Um, so it's just about, are they able to tell me, oh, there's more blocks here um, and there's less blocks here. And um, it's just inc encouraging that other language that's starting to come in and, and them understanding that um, so it's just about maybe um, encouraging this at home and supporting this at home would be um, oh how many um, how many potatoes have I got on my dinner I've got the same as you or I've got more than you or um, I've got lots of potatoes <laughs> something like that um, personal social emotional development uh, will be encouraging the children to feel strong, confident individuals. Um, I know some of them are going to be moving through to preschool and I think they are more than ready and they will um, absolutely flourish and carry on doing really well in preschool too. Um, so some of the suggested reads this term, um, you might be able to uh, choose to support the topic, would be um, Night Monkey, Day Monkey, Whatever Next, or See You Later, Alligator. Um, yeah, so that's a, just a really quick overview to let you know what your children are going to be focusing on this term. Again, any questions, please do speak to myself, Mrs Warwick, or we've got Miss Hone, Miss Orton, or anyone in the nursery team, and we will be happy to help you. And I look forward, and we all do look forward to seeing the children back this for the final term. Really exciting, lovely term, lots going on. Um, so... Yes, thank you for listening.